Flipping through channels one day, I saw Thomas Air on PBS, and Young Me realized that that's for Thomas Ayers. That's the story. Alright, now that you know when I started watching Thomas on PBS, time to talk about me gushing over watching it there. Thomas technically got started in PBS with Shining Time in 1989, but in 2004 it would be there on its own thing, airing episodes from the 8th season all the way up to the 20th. However, not every episode from 1920 aired. Most of the show has at least aired on PBS once, except for... The following is how these episodes would air on PBS during seasons 8 and 9. It would be a season 8 episode, a learning segment, music video, season 7 episode, another learning segment, and season 8 episode. During season 9, however, while the structure was the exact same, there would be a chance a season 6 episode would air instead of a season 7 one. Renarrated in all by Michael Brandon. After a Thomas airing, com commonly a promotion for Learning Curve or a real life train system called Amtrak would be aired right after. Starting with season 10, 6 and 7 episode reruns would be dropped. By September of 2013, PBS would officially stop airing model episodes, because I guess by that point there was over 100 CGI ones, so they're like, eh, we don't need those anymore. The show would officially end its run on PBS by 2017 of December of that year. Thomas was pretty big on PBS for quite a while. I remember it being advertised a decent bit throughout the new series, and hell, even the Miller era had quite a bit of promotion too. It definitely did seem like a pretty good spot to watch it, even if it only aired once a day. I should also state I have very fond memories watching the beginning and ending of season 11 air on this network. It was the first time I had ever watched an entire Thomas season within like the spam of as it was airing, so it was like a really cool thing for young me to do. But yeah, I was definitely an active viewer of PBS from like 2006 up to kinda 2010-ish. By the point Thomas switched to CGI and the time Misty Island Rescue came out, I don't know, I felt like I was kinda getting old for the franchise and I moved on to other things. And while I did inevitably return to this tank engine, I wouldn't really watch any of the episodes that were airing by the point I came back to this franchise on PBS. I don't know, I guess I just didn't feel like it. But I always cherish those memories of watching the show there, as you know, it was the only place I really could. You know, I'm curious how you guys are going to feel about this one, because this one was a little harder to talk about, because, you know, this wasn't a release or anything. This was a TV broadcasting of the show, but I just kind of wanted to give you a little, you know, hint into how I felt about watching these for the first time growing up. And thank you all for watching. And please uh, stay tuned for another Thomas Nostalgia. I can't wait to do more of these. Bye.